a surprising cause of diabetes and a new treatment. This is a very interesting study. They looked at the transfer of intestinal microbiota from lean donors and found that it increased insulin sensitivity in people with pre-diabetic syndrome. Now, what does that mean? It means that they took someone's microbiota or gut bacteria or a poop sample and they put it in another person. And they had two groups in this study. They took uh, people with a lean donor and transferred that poo into a heavy person to see what it did. And then they, for the control, took a heavy person and put their own poo back in them. Will that improve their insulin's function? We know that poor insulin function is connected with heart disease, hypertension, stroke, cancer, and type 2 diabetes. And we know that it shortens your life when your insulin's not working correctly. Here's what the study showed. Amazing results. So here's the insulin function on the lean person. Very good. This was the obese person's insulin function, and this is what happened in a very short period of time. Significant improvement in insulin function, which means their risk for diabetes just went down significantly. Six weeks, this much improvement. Now what happened to the control? When they put their own poo back in them, of course, nothing happened. So keep the good bacteria in your gut. And I'm not suggesting that you have a fecal transplant like they did in this study. Simply use probiotics and eat lots of vegetables because these bacteria thrive when there's fiber down there to eat. And be very cautious about using antibiotics because one course of antibiotics will wipe out all of your good bacteria for up to two years. Follow the seven systems plan for all of these tips.